Into the night, I see nothing but stars falling. Hi guys, I'm Ali, and it's been more than a hot second since I made my last video. Um, it was my summer break for the past two months, and I think I only made like two videos because I got really lazy, but I was also really busy doing a lot of stuff, so I'm gonna give you guys a few life updates before I get into my shopping haul. So if you guys haven't noticed, my hair is brown now. Um, I've had colored hair for the past three years, and I just decided that I really needed to take a break because all the dye and bleach that I've put into my hair uh, I feel like my hair needs to rest because I don't want it to fall out you know also if you've noticed my background looks a lot different from my other videos and that's because I rearranged my room recently I think this new setup is really cute because now I have a lot more art prints and new photos that I got to put up because I have so many it's just stored away because I didn't have enough room in my old wall now but now I have two walls and like it's just so cute I'm just so happy I'm currently back in school again the sub just started and this is the time where I decided to start making YouTube videos again so I've actually been working on a lot of personal projects over the past two months which is why I haven't really been focusing on making YouTube videos the first major one that I've actually been really excited about is that I'm putting up new music again for the first time in such a long time um, if you guys are interested in listening to a few originals that I made I posted them up on my SoundCloud and I also tend to post a bit on Instagram about the music I've been writing it's actually really exciting for me because I've been recently trying to develop a new style for my music because I got kind of bored with the same routine and the same sound of just using my guitar. I've been learning how to use software to make music for my songs. It's really helped me stay motivated into putting out music and writing new things and I'm really creatively inspired right now so I'm really happy because I've been in such a slump for so long. The next major thing is art. Uh, I used to draw so much when I was a kid, but over the past years, I guess I haven't had a lot of motivation or I wasn't very inspired. But now I really am on this like creative high, so like I've been trying to put out so much stuff, um, like music and art and everything. So I'm really learning again how to like get back into it. And I'm really excited because uh, if you guys didn't know, me and my friend Aki, we actually have a shop now on Instagram. I'll post the link in the description below for that as well our shop is called 22 yen and we actually do a few events here in the Philippines in Manila our next one is going to be comic Ken in October and we're really excited because we're gonna be putting out a lot of new art and a lot of new merch and if you guys are in the Manila area I hope you guys can come and support us and just have fun I have so many like life updates because it's been so long but I have two more before I got into my haul okay I'm so sorry <laughs> I know that's what you guys are anticipating and I'm just talking about my life. I have my own shop on Instagram called Ali Flavored Closet and if you guys want to check it out there's a lot of pre-loved items and brand new items that I put up there from my own personal collection and you get them at a really affordable price and I have a lot of like rare finds there that I've collected like here in the Philippines, from Japan and like even in the US so if you guys are interested in the kind of style that you always see me wear there are actually a few pieces there that might be on my shop and yeah you just gotta check it out I've been recently learning how to sew but it's for this other personal project that I'm working on with another friend of mine but since it's still in the works I'll give you more information and updates when I have them <laughs> but for now yeah it's just kind of a secret but I'm really excited for it so I hope you guys stay tuned oh, okay wait by the way I have this really cute pearl beret in my hair I woke up like an hour ago. I don't know if it's that noticeable in my hair, but I tried to be cute and put this in. If you guys like it, it's from this really cute IG shop called Achibea Corner that was kind enough to promote me and give me a few items. And their stuff is really, really affordable. A lot of them are just under $5 here from Manila. And yeah, if you guys like them, I'll also put their link for their store in the description down below. So the first thing that I want to share with you guys is my new school bag. It's actually an Ita bag uh, because it has that clear section, but like look at it. It's so cute. I just thought that putting stuffed toys in it would be really, really cute. And it is, but like, yo, I'm a college student. I look like a 
three-year-old and it's just so funny but like I can't help it like I just like cute things and like yeah I don't know if you guys can really notice some of the details here with like the bread strawberry and cream stuff they actually didn't come with the bag I put these pieces on myself with like like super glue because I thought it'd be really cute but it's actually just a clear bag and then I got it in white but there are a lot of different colors and like yeah I've collected these plushies uh, throughout the years because I used to go to a lot of anime conventions and I have a few cute keychains here as well on the side that I got from Guam and my Japan trip and yeah I actually really like this bag because of instead of an all clear backpack it only shows a clear pocket on the top and the bottom but the biggest pouch in this bag is actually not see through I just was so scared if people could see all my stuff like I don't want to get robbed so like I'm really glad that this one is just like a regular backpack but this part is clear so I could still design it and people could see what I want them to see so yeah it's so so cute I don't remember all the prices for my items I'm pretty sure this one was around 700 pesos which is a little bit over ten dollars i think that's around like fifteen dollars so the next bag i want to share with you guys is this purse that i got it's really cute it's like an embroidered flower heart-shaped bag they also have it in different colors but i chose white i just find this like super cute and it's easy to match with a lot of my outfits recently it even matches my beret so i'm like really excited to put together outfits with this bag and like yeah it was really cheap i think i only paid like 300 pesos for it that's like around six dollars and like it's a good size i can put all my necessities in it like my keys my phone my wallet it all fits in here i have used it only once so far but i only got it last week next item i want to share with you guys is this jelly pouch it's a bento brand pouch it's so so cute i'm actually so surprised that they have bento branded items on shopee uh it's actually like really great because bento is kind of hard to find in a lot of other places i got this for a really good price i think this was like 250 or to 300 again that's only five to six dollars so i think that's really cool for just a bentoy branded pouch it's so cute i like the design on it it's like this really cute gummy bear girl and i actually put my camera in it because my camera is actually pretty small okay so the last bag i want to share with you guys is a tote bag and it's this bag it's really cute i got this for like 200 pesos which is like four dollars and the print is so cute there were a handful of different prints to choose from but i got this like strawberry milk kind of one because strawberry milk is like my favorite drink <laughs> so i got this one okay so we're moving on to the clothing which is the most anticipated part so the first item i want to share with you guys is this really cute blue dress uh, it has like this really cute kind of white flower design you can see it better on the bottom but i was really happy about this dress um i'm so excited to put the links in the description down below because most of the items that i got are from one shoppy shop on site and i was really really happy about the quality of their clothing and how true to the size it is a lot of other items that you find on shopee are a little hard to gauge what sizes they'll actually be especially if uh they're asian sizes because they usually run much smaller and i'm not like a small girl so like i was really excited because a bunch of the stuff that i have are actually stretchy so yeah i got this really cute blue dress it has like these puffy sleeves i can make it off shoulder if i choose to or put them up a little bit i can wear them in different ways um the length is really good i feel like this is uh not too short so i can wear it to like family events and not get judged for it because it's not too short <laughs> so like yeah it, it was it's really nice i think i got this for around like 600 to 700 pesos um i know that these items for the clothing aren't the cheapest but i think that it's worth it because the quality and the sizes are true and definitely gonna get more items from this shop i swear like they had so much cute clothing and i had to limit myself because a girl is broke <laughs> so the next item i want to share with you guys is a gingham piece who am i without gingham you know and who am i without my off shoulder shirts because I feel like I've been really into this style recently. So I have a bunch of shirts that have the same kind of shape. But I don't care. This is really, really cute. This is a red gingham. Um, 
off shoulder blouse with buttons in the middle that go all the way down it's so cute and i feel like this piece can match a lot of stuff and i just really love gingham like i don't care if it ever goes out of style it is the cutest thing ever like i feel like a picnic basket and that's okay so I actually just remembered that I have this other top that I got from the same shop but I can't currently show it to you guys because it's in the wash because I already wore it. I got this really cute blouse in blue. It came in a lot of other colors. It's made with like this satin fabric or like silky fabric and I really liked it because in the back it's like a corset ribbon kind of style and it was so cute. I felt like a princess. So like I said, I'm really into like the kind of corset off shoulder blouse style so I got another shirt and it's in white but it's so cute because like the corset part is kind of in the front and it has like a small like ribbon that you can tie at the end I just feel like this really flatters my body I think this is one of the cheaper blouses that I got I'm pretty sure this was like only like 250 or 300 and that's literally like five to six dollars okay I'm so excited about this next item because it's a two-piece set like I've always wanted a two-piece set I don't think I actually own one until now so the one I got I actually posted a short like clip of it on Instagram and you guys are already asking where I got it so here it is um, this is what the top looks like it's so cute again it's off shoulder but there's a tie ribbon right here in the front and like yeah it has like this really cute lace detail and the bottom is actually a skirt and it's also a pretty good size and it's also elastic so I can stretch it out and I really really like it I feel like a princess in it so to be honest this is one of the most favorited items that I got recently from Shopee and I was so excited to find it I was really scared it wasn't gonna and they like look good on me but like it looked good on me okay the second to last item I want to share with you guys isn't clothing but like it's an accessory so I got this chain belt it's so cute it's really simple but I really like it it's supposed to say girl on it but like the L broke off and I have I have the L but I, I have to like put it back so just girl right now girl right now okay <laughs> It's cute. I got it for like 200 pesos. It's like four dollars and I like to like layer it like with my uh, clothing and then put my extra chain on the side so I have more chains <laughs> and I think it's really cute. I really wanted one that had like words on it but I, it was so hard to find on Shopee so you guys are so lucky that I'm putting the link in the description because I did all this searching for you. So yeah if you guys want to be twinning like just get this one. Actually there were a few more to choose from but I think the only ones that had words were girl and lady on it and they come in silver and gold last time I checked. Okay, so I saved the best for last and that is the dress that I'm currently wearing. It's my favorite dress in my closet right now. It's so cute. I was so excited to find it. Uh, it's this ribbon tie cloud dress. It has like a sweetheart neckline. I really, really love it because the bottom half of this dress isn't like a bodycon uh, style. It's more like a bit of an A-line style, which I really like because A-lines flatter my body a lot more. I feel so cute in it. Like there's so much lace. It's really girly, really feminine. And yeah, it's my favorite. It was one of the more pricier items that I got, but I don't care because this is literally the cutest thing ever. And I was really excited to find this because of the style it was in. There's a bunch of stuff with the cloud pattern on it on Shopee recently, but a lot of it was kind of tight-fitted bodycon style. And yeah, if you ain't about that life like me, I will be putting the link in the description below for this because it is the best thing I have ever bought in my entire life. Oh shoot, wait, I forgot to mention that I actually bought a lot more stuff on Shopee but they're not clothing related and there are a few that are in my favorites right now so I'm thinking of making a July favorites video even though it's August already. So yeah, that ends my Shopee haul for this video today and I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Till next time, bye!